I paint a picture like an artist with his heart. Inside the paint, I go hard enough to make it even though my odds are slim. Uh, my name is Jamal Gumbush. I go to Cardozo High School. I'm 18 years old, and I play ball for my mom, my dad. This week, my mom wants a hood. Simple as that. And it's like I play ball because like it's fun for me. It's I get out of trouble. Like I don't, I don't do drugs. My mom happy. It's like just trying to be great for her and my dad. Simple as that. Playing for Marty Hawks is great. It's my family. Q is like. Like, he's one like, I could say he's really one of my close friends, like really my close friend, as a coach, because he taught me well. And playing with him, it's like, it's great. Playing with my friends, it's lovely. I like playing with Cardozo, it's like, it's big, because like, everybody like, wants to play for Cardozo, and I'm on the team, and so everybody want to be in that spot. But now I'm on the team, I humble myself, Q taught me how to humble myself, and I'll, I'll take nothing for granted. Like, like I play everything like, everything like, like it's my last, simple as that. And so, I'm just like all things for Q, because Q put me on the team because of him. Thank you. This wasn't a trial that wasn't planned. Uh, this trial was not planned at all. It was not. I did it last minute for a reason. I don't want superstars. I like kids that I got to take from the ground and build them up. That's what I want. I don't care for stars. That don't mean nothing. I don't want stars. All right, that's number one. Um, number two, like I said, it's snowing. I'm glad you came. It is what it is. Um, we got more uh, later on. Um, like I said before, I had a lot of people ask me, like I put on Facebook before, y'all already know, but a lot of people ask me all the time, why are you doing it during high school season? I'm gonna tell you straight into your face, but I want sleepers. I want sleepers. I want kids that don't know, have a clue what the game is about, so when I make you good, and when you move on to the next level, then people will wake up and say, where was this kid, where was this kid? That's what I want. I want sleepers, all right? We want kids that we gotta move. During the spring, I also want to do free tournaments for you guys as well. Free tournaments, we don't got paid down. Probably just referee fees and that's it, but I'm trying to do free things as well. During the spring, I'm gonna have some college players come down that play Division One, come down and talk to you guys this time going too as well. We're gonna have that. I'm gonna have some pro players that I know of that play overseas, a little bit guys that played in NBA a couple of years ago that's gonna come down and talk to you guys. And also some N1 Street Ball legends that like Hot Sauce, like Main Event, I don't know if you know those guys, but I grew up playing with those guys. They want to come down too and talk to y'all as well, which is good, which is real good, all right? So you can see the street ball life and you can see professional life as well. So you see both sides, all right? I'm not going to lie to you straightforward. I don't care if you score 20. I don't care if you score 10. I don't care if you score 50 in the scrimmage, whatever the case is. If at the end of the day you're not playing defense, or at the end of the day you score 20, but the man you guarded has 35, that don't mean nothing. That don't mean nothing. You can make, if you think that you want to come on the court and just do everything in the world, crossing there, crossing about 5,000 people, go ahead. Trust and believe, I do not care. You can make someone fall, it definitely doesn't impress me. I made people fall all my, when I was playing ball, so I won't care. Trust and believe, I won't care. It doesn't mean nothing. Let's go do a quick sprint down and back. Right after that, we're going to do three man weave real quick and then move on. Go! One. Good, two, three lines, three lines, go. Three lines, three, 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 let's go. Three lines, quick. Wait, wait, good. Yeah, three lines, three lines, guys, my fault. And Mari, go in front of Malachi first. Malachi, go on the wing, go on the wing. I want you on the wing, Malachi. I want you on the wing, Malachi. Good, let's go, let's go, good. Always have your hands out, always have your hands out when you're coming around the wing. Always have your hands out when you come around the wing. Next, let's go. Go, Malachi, run, Malachi, you gotta run, buddy. You gotta run. Good. All I need is five, all I need right now, if I have 12 players on this team, all I need is 12 players that has heart. That's all I care about. This and this, mentality and heart, that's all I care about. I've been running this program with straight guards. The only big I had was I got lucky, one kid named Lewis, who's like 6'6 now, I got last year. Everybody else before then was all his height and his height. And we took championships everywhere. All right? I don't care for height. The one thing I like to be is a fundamental transition team. We're going to do three sets of games. All right? First game is no um, dribbling. The second one is one, per, one dribble per person. The third one is um, just regular, like always, basketball. All right? 
Major key thing with me, when I read, especially, not even just trials, but just in general, when I'm scouting for colleges or helping kids get into schools, I watch everything. I watch your adjustments, I watch your, your mentally, how you act on the court, what you can do, how many shots you go up. A lot of people say they score 30, but they score, they shooting the ball 5,000 times. If you shoot the ball 5,000 times and don't score 30, then that's terrible. That's terrible, that means you definitely can't shoot. That means you definitely can't play the game, all right? It's a numbers game when it comes to basketball, it's a numbers game when you're trying to get recruited for college. That's how it works. When they watch and when they see your game, they see what you can do, what's your weaknesses, and they see how much shots you're throwing up to score the amount of points you have. All right, so always remember that. All right, so that's what I usually do as well. So, what we're gonna do now is, I'm gonna set the teams. The first one, we're gonna do half court setting first. All right, I wanna do a two on two half court setting first, because I wanna see what I have and what you can do in a two on two. So let me first get Amari. Let me first get um, Ant. Let me get Jamai. And let me get RJ. Let me get a ball. Get a ball right there, buddy. These two here, RJ and Jamai. Jamai just got this year. RJ been with me since he was a freshman. All right. The next trial I have, you're going to see my uh, other guys I got. I got Mamadou, Cameron, Marquise, um, Kyrie. I have um, a lot of guys. Lewis, Julian, Jesley, Mark. Those are all guys, Christian, I have all those guys that have been playing with me since they was freshmen. They've been playing with me since they was freshmen, all right? All right, so game is gonna be two points, simple. No dribbles, all right? Two points, no dribbles, go. Good. Set a screen, set a pick, set a pick, sorry. Be tough, be tough. The pass, one up. Point up, let's go, it's straight, let's go, it's straight. Good. Cut. Good. Put your arm, um, RJ, Jamai, stay on. Let's go. Good, take your time. Good, RJ. Relax, good. One zip. Come on, guys, gotta play on them. Let's go. One zip. Game point. Ooh. If he had his bounce, he would have dunked it. One up. If he had his bounce, he would have dunked it. He got tired. It's that, it's that job, man. That's good, that's good. Good, 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 good. Two, all right, get off. Listen up. As you can see, one thing is when you had these two guys on the floor, that's the one thing we teach. Move without the ball. And once a team plays pressure on you and can stop your dribble, I teach you on how to get open on certain areas of the court to knock down your shot to knock down your shot. Because as time go on, not just in youth basketball, but when I'm trying to go higher and try to be, actually I'm not gonna lie to you, I'm trying to be one of the top programs coming out of Queens, we gonna be playing teams that is tough. They have tough competition. Tough guards, tough bigs, and they actually play defense, and they actually stop the ball, they actually get the job done. And you gotta sit there and use your brain to actually find out where to score on the court. All right, so that's the one key, one key. Thank <laughs> you.